let's talk uh, footwork on a little bit of basics on our footwork. Uh, what we are looking at is an eight point cone. As you can tell, there's four parts that's blue and then four parts that's white. So let's consider the left leg blue, okay? So we'll call this uh, one, two, three, and four, and we're gonna call that five, six, seven, and eight. So if we're gonna talk about just basic footwork, okay? So notice how Mr. Hashan has his feet on an, on an X, right? On a plus sign, okay, relatively squared. And this toe, okay, let's go ahead and straighten that out for me and then lift your heel up off the floor slightly up. Good, so that's, that's our regular Krav Maga fighting stance. Keeping it very basic, very easy to manipulate, right? You wanna stay upright. So if we're talking about transferable skills, you wanna shoot as comfortable as possible. And if you're gonna use force multipliers and, and firearms, we wanna actually be able to fight the same, okay? So, so all the blue is, is uh, the left leg and all the white is the right leg. So number one is moving forward. So you, Mr. Sean is either gonna step forward, right? Lead with the left foot first since it's blue, and then match with the right. Okay, go ahead and reset. Good, so number one is going forward. Good, and then back up, right? Number two is diagonally to the side. Good, reset. Number three is horizontal. Good, reset. So number four is a little bit funky, right? So you're going to go backwards and then switch your stance by dragging back and then diagonally bursting backwards. Bang, okay, reset. Okay, so that's the first half, which is all left leg. Second half is all right leg first. Okay, so the next one is going backwards, starting with the right leg, bursting back, and then moving forward, or stepping back, moving forward. Second one is diagonally off angle. Bang, and then reset. The next one is horizontal, and then reset. And then this last little funky one is called an L step, right? So it's a boxer's L step. So from that position, he's going to lead Okay, with the left foot first instead of the right, except the right foot is actually gonna be going in this direction. Ready? One, two, three, four. Okay, one more time. Good, it's gonna be one, two, bang, bang. And then three, four, bursting in that direction. Back on. So there's a reason why we have this in this fashion. So the X, in terms of self-defense, is where you are being attacked, okay? So number one is obviously pure offense, right? Or in an offensive motion, he's moving forward. Okay, hands up. There you go, reset. Okay, so now this one you can treat it as a burst. Okay, so big, big, strong burst. For example, throwing a jab cross, bang, bang. Good, reset. So now this one going offline could be with the intent of evading and having a counter offense at the same time. All right, for example, an overhand cross. So if I were to move forward, he's gonna burst diagonally and throw the overhand cross, bang, reset. So the third one is a little bit more of an evasive motion. For example, if I were to, to, to throw an overhand cross, okay, he moves offline, bang, and then throws a counter, okay? The next one is bursting offline and, and in a diagonal fashion, okay, just to stay away because, like I said, the X is where you are being attacked, so you don't wanna be there. So if I were to execute a large kick, boom, comes out offline, and then sends his offense. Okay, same thing with the right leg. So uh, this time, if I'm moving forward, he's moving back, bang, and then counter offense, bang. Good, reset. Other one would be in that direction, okay? So if I were to come in, good, and then reset. And then this one, if I were to use, let's say, the opposite front kick, boom, comes out, moving horizontally. Good, one more time, whoops. One more time, if I were to use an opposite side, and he's gonna burst off offline, bang. Good. And then the last one, that little funky L-step is, for example, if I were to throw my jab, okay, he's gonna L-step out, kind of like a Mike Tyson movement, and then throw that hook punch to the solar plexus. Bang, bang, bang. All right, here we go. Starting from a normal Krav Maga fighting stance, which is relatively squared and boxy, right on his hips, okay? And his feet and toes are pointed forward, okay? Number one, uh, all the blue cones will be the left leg, and all the white cones are the right leg leading first, okay? Number one is forward. Number two is diagonal forward. Number three is horizontal. Four is dragging the left foot backwards and a burst backwards. 
Good. Number five is the white cone. Right leg leads first, backwards. Number six is diagonal. Number seven is horizontal. And number eight is our L step. Pop, 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 pop. Do what is hard today and do the impossible tomorrow.